the control buttons as the name suggests the control buttons help us in controlling the paint window they are minimize button restore down or maximize button and close button you can find them on the top right corner of the paint window let us discuss them one by one minimize button it is represented by a dash sign when clicked the paint window gets minimized the paint window is not closed but becomes invisible from desktop its icon gets placed on the taskbar clicking on this icon makes the window again visible restore down button it is represented by two small overlapping square boxes when click the size of the paint window gets reduced the button gets replaced by the maximize button you will now find a single square on the button at this stage you can resize the window as per your need by dragging the edges of the window clicking again on the button which is now maximize button enlarges the window and makes it full screen you can also make the window full screen by double clicking on the title bar close button it is represented by a cross sign when clicked it closes the program window if you have drawn something in paint before closing the window it will ask you to save your work colors in paint paint provides you with different color options so that you can draw colorful and attractive pictures the color section has three parts color 1 and color 2 buttons color 1 is the primary color or the foreground color whereas color 2 is the secondary or the background color the primary color is with which you draw when you use the left mouse button and the secondary is the one with which you draw when you use the right mouse button color palette the color palette has 3 rows The first two rows contain 20 different color swatches whereas the third row displays only the edited colors. These edited colors vanish away once the paint window is closed. Initially, the third row contains blank squares. Edit colors. This option helps you to edit the colors. For example, you can lighten or darken the colors.